10 Egypt Discoveries Nobody Can Explain The ancient Egyptian civilization is one of the oldest and most significant in human history. Some of the advances made during this period continue to confuse historians, scientists, archaeologists, and the general public alike. And here are some of them. Number 10. How the Pyramids Were Built The question of how the pyramids were built has confused scientists for multiple millennia. These magnificent structures were, for thousands of years, the tallest buildings in the world, but they were made at a time when we had no machines or modern technology. This has led to a lot of speculation, especially by conspiracy theorists, concerning how exactly were the ancient Egyptians able to construct such an architectural marvel with the limited resources they had. The answer to that? We really don't know yet. It's possible that the Egyptians had access to construction methods that wouldn't be figured out again for centuries to come. But it's also possible that they may have had some extraterrestrial help in their construction. Number 9. 100 Coffins in Saqqara Saqqara is home to one of Egypt's most fascinating discoveries. Some of the largest pyramids in the world outside of Giza have been found here. And more discoveries, especially in recent times, continue to be made here all the time. In November of 2020, Saqqara once again made global headlines, as over 100 unknown tombs were discovered during an excavation at the site. These coffins were considered perfectly preserved, and all of them had incredible detail all over them. The high quality of these coffins can probably be attributed to the fact that the people inside these coffins might have belonged to the ruling or elite class in ancient Egypt, so they had access to higher quality materials for their deathbeds. These coffins are believed to be at least 2,500 years old, and along with them, numerous pieces of jewelry and golden masks were found. Number 8. The Town of the Tomb Builders We all wonder what life was really like for the workers and peasants of the ancient Egyptian empire. Who exactly was building these magnificent structures with incredible detail? Was it slaves, bonded labor, or voluntary workers? Well, this one discovery in the town of Deir al-Medina might have the answer to that question. Deir al-Medina is an ancient village that is considered a temporary village for workers working in the Valley of the Kings to reside in. Some rather unique statues have been found in this village, such as this one from the tomb of Ka and Merit. The village is at least 3,000 years old and over four centuries of community life and history have been uncovered from this site. It showed that residents of the village, despite being construction workers themselves, had access to servants and also worked as farmers on the side. Artwork from this village gives us the most extensive look into ancient Egyptian life that we've ever had. Number 7. The Temples of Abu Simbel The ancient Egyptian religion is one of the most confusing aspects of the ancient Egyptian civilization overall. The confusion part comes from the sheer diversity of the religion, as there were many gods that throughout time lost their significance and the religion underwent bouts of monotheism and polytheism, with even the rulers considered gods themselves at points. Some of the most famous temples from ancient Egyptian times are the temples of Abu Simbel. Located near the southern border of Egypt with Sudan, the Abu Simbel temple complex consists of the great temple of Ramesses II as well as the smaller temples of Hathor and Nefertari. They contain some of the biggest statues ever found in ancient Egypt, but due to the damage they were suffering in their location, it was decided that the statues would be removed and placed on a carved mountain. Number 6. Rosetta Stone For thousands of years, ancient Egypt was considered a lost civilization. Not lost in the sense that it was long gone, but rather a civilization lost in history with not much information about it being known. The reason for this was the ancient Egyptian language, which was undecipherable up until Napoleon's campaign in Egypt. In 1799, the French army discovered the Rosetta Stone near the city of Luxor, and the stone contained a decree that was written in both Greek and ancient Egyptian. Since the French authorities were able to translate the Greek text, it gave us the first chance to ever decipher the ancient Egyptian language and is the reason we know so much about Egyptian history today. While many languages have come and gone over time, the ancient Egyptian language was preserved due to this stone alone. Number 5. Mystery Schools 
The ancient Egyptian people were quite knowledgeable even when compared to modern civilizations. And there are a lot of secrets about ancient Egyptian society that we still don't know much about. It's alleged that a lot of the knowledge and wisdom in ancient Egypt came from mystery schools. So what are mystery schools? Well, they were basically centers of knowledge for only the most educated among the Egyptian elite. These schools were where children of royalty, even pharaohs, were sent off in order to become among Egypt's wisest scholars. They were especially important sites for Egyptian history and religious knowledge, and may have played a huge role in shaping the ancient Egyptian civilization overall. Unfortunately, most of these schools were lost over time, but may have contained some vital information on the history of Egypt even before the pyramids were built. Number 5. Khufu Ship Have you ever wondered how ancient kings traveled across the world? This discovery might just answer that question for you. While King Khufu is probably best known for building one of the famous pyramids of Giza, there's also one other project of his that has caught the eye of archaeologists and historians across the world. The Khufu ship is the single oldest sea vessel ever found, and it was rediscovered in 1954. It was found in over 1,200 pieces, and was eventually put back together entirely without any new pieces added. It's not known where exactly this ship sailed, if it ever even did. But to find a ship that can be dated back to over 4,500 years ago is a marvel in and of itself. Number 3. The Tomb of Tutankhamun Tutankhamun was one of Egypt's most well-known pharaohs, and his golden mask alone has turned into a major symbol of the ancient civilization. But even as his legacy continued to intrigue historians, his tomb was never really found until in 1907 when a team of archaeologists discovered funerary items that seemed to have been for King Tut. From there, they continued to search for the missing tomb for years, and just as luck was about to run out in 1922, a water boy for the archaeologists accidentally slipped over a rock which ended up being the top of a stairway that directly led to the tomb. After clearing the stairway, they were finally able to discover King Tut's body and also discovered that the entrance to his tomb had been breached at least twice before then. To this day, we have no idea who breached the tomb before and what they may have taken. Number 2. Hatshepsut's Mummy Hatshepsut was only Egypt's second female pharaoh, and she was one of the most prolific rulers in the history of Egypt. During her time, we saw some of Egypt's most famous monuments other than the Giza be built including the Great Temple of Hatshepsut. But even after all these incredible discoveries, one thing that was never found out about Hatshepsut was her mummy. Her tomb was discovered in 1920, but it was empty. While they had found a mummy lying on the floor in a nearby location, among many other mummies found in the same way, they assumed it couldn't have been Hatshepsut. As it turned out, in 2009, almost 100 years after that initial mummy was found, a box containing Hatshepsut's tooth was discovered. After conducting a DNA test of the tooth with the long-forgotten mummy, they were able to actually identify the mummy as Hatshepsut herself. Number 1. The True Age of the Sphinx Along with the Great Pyramids, the Sphinx in Giza is considered an iconic symbol of the ancient Egyptian civilization and one of the most well-known historical structures on Earth. The Sphinx has always been the subject of numerous conspiracy theories, and the reason for that is we don't know anything about it. Unlike the pyramids, which are considered accurately dated, we don't exactly know how long ago the Sphinx was built. It was initially thought to have been built by King Khafre, who built one of the pyramids, but structural research shows the Sphinx is actually much older. In fact, the Sphinx may have been older than the pyramids by thousands of years. There is water damage on the Sphinx that may have been from a time when Giza actually resembled more of a tropical rainforest rather than an ancient desert. The true age of the Sphinx is a mystery, and we might never be able to figure it out. That's a wrap for this video, and if you enjoyed it, make sure to leave us a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. We'll see you next time.